And President Obama is expected to sign that bill that will keep across the board tax hikes from hitting your wallet. But guess what? Most of you may still be going to see less take home pay. News 13's Tina Jensen is live in the Newsplex to tell us why, Tina. Well, all workers can expect to pay 2% more in Social Security taxes this year. That's because the measure passed by Congress doesn't extend the Social Security tax cut that we've had the past two years. So the payroll tax will rise from 4.2% to 6.2%. People making $50,000 a year will see about $1,000 more out of their paycheck. Uh, one way to sort of offset some of this is to continue to fund your retirement plans, something like a 401k or 403b. By putting money in those, you're, you're exempting yourself. Those dollars do not get taxable for income and Social Security purposes. So that's one way to decrease your liabilities. It's estimated that 77% of American households will face these higher federal taxes in 2013 under this agreement. Back to you. Tina, thank you for that. That tax increase went into effect yesterday, and it is expected to bring in about $120 billion in revenue each year.